Uh, hey folks, uh, Ryan Davis, Brad Shoemaker here. We are checking out Diabolical Pitch for Xbox 360 Connect. Uh, this is from Grasshopper Manufacturer. Uh, those crazy, ridiculous fools. Uh, Suda51, yeah. the, the head of those crazy fools. Is this actually a Goichi Suda joint? Uh, it's, it's know? Certainly, you know what? It certainly feels like it. it. Smells like one. Uh, yeah, it, it definitely does. Uh, this is a dark fantasy baseball pitching game okay. for Connect. Okay. Uh, and We'll get into it, and you will see that yeah, this this feels distinctly like a uh, a suit of joints. Teach me in the ways of demonic baseball. As you can see here already, the uh, the the fire demon arm on our pitcher, uh, who I believe his name is McAllister. Kid's got a hell of an arm. He definitely does. You throw some heat, uh, and we're just gonna go into the the very beginning of this game, just kind of get to to know it. So. Uh, <laughs> The diabolical pitch is an actual ability that your guy has. Okay. By by taking down enemies, by throwing baseballs at them, uh, you can charge up your diabolical pitch, which is basically your super move. Uh, you can also catch balls, and you can also kick dudes. You know, like in baseball. Sure. Um, fire is what I've used before, so I'm going to stick with that. Uh, I haven't seen thunder yet, but uh, we'll see if we can switch it up a little bit here. You saw in the main menu there that there's also a multiplayer option. Uh, in the game. Here we'll get a little story set up. So far, if he can get it out here, he'll have achieved one of the most amazing winning streaks in baseball. I mean, if there's one thing Suda loves, it's taking like American Western yeah. pop culture, yeah. traditional stuff, and just turning it on its fucking ear. Yep. Absolutely incredible. He's a real genre guy, right? Yeah, definitely. Like he'll go for like a like a grindhouse thing, or well, he he very it seems like he very specifically has a a, a thing for. You know, Americana. Right, right. Like, like taking that stuff and making it real, real, real weird. He'll like identify a certain cinematic style and then just sort of like turn it 45 degrees. Oh, McAllister's arm. There's something wrong with it. I think there's something very what right with his arm. Your dreams will come true. Oh, yeah. You're American also fighting uh, like theme park, ma theme park well, mascots. Explain the Steve scary Steve rabbits that I saw earlier. Mm -hmm. Okay. I can't believe this is it. But I've finally given up hope. Uh, I should note this is a downloadable title, like also, this. so uh, it kind of makes a lot of the experimental weirdness uh, make a little more sense. Let's go down a little easier. I think so. Welcome. Oh. <laughs> Such as hell? scary demonic cow yeah, head. What kind of mascot is that? Where am I? What? It's the don't devil. Tell me you don't know. Oh. It's Queen Christine's Dreamland. Oh, dear. Right. Queen Christine's Dreamland? The place where your dreams come true? That's right. Mm. Is there something wrong with your arm? You could say that. Well then, not, try putting not doing it for me. It's not good when the head uh, spins all the way around. Oh. Here, put this on. Anywhere in this park. In this case, it's like a mechanical oh, arm. Wait. Two seconds ago, I couldn't move my arm an inch, and now it's moving again. Well, we hope you enjoy your time here at Queen Christine's That was the wrong hand. That was the left hand. Wait a second. What's going on here? We wouldn't want you to go home just yet. You must understand. All dreams come... What's going on here? Some Suda51 stuff. Do what do you think the theme takes. of this theme park is? <laughs> Satan. All right. The range is narrow, but the attacking power is great. That's what I've got, is the fireball, so. So it seems like the aiming is, is pretty forgiving on this. I'd be curious to see just how, uh, how specific it gets with directions, but. Uh, so far, it's just a uh, throw like that. Alistair kind of throws like a girl, don't you think? You know, I'm just kind of going in the general direction. Yeah, are you even really aiming here? Here, I'm going to use my diabolical uh, pitch here. Activate. Seems pretty responsive so far. Oh, well, again. Nope, both hands are up. Nope, come on. Pretty simple also. Yeah. Can you miss? See if you can miss. 
Well, so far there is something in all of the areas that I'm trying to hit, so. Fire. Oh. Awesome. You know, if this is one of those games that they announced, uh, remember when they had that TGS press conference where they were like, yeah, we're making a new Steel Battalion, and the Panzer Dragoon guys are doing I something? I know. You know what? I hadn't heard of this until, uh, like, earlier this week. Okay. Because they had, they had that big Connect initiative where all these kind of Japanese developers were coming out of the woodwork to do stuff. Come on. I think, I think Haunt was a product of that. I believe you're right. Okay, there's also, in again, in Suda51 style, he loves his slot machine conventions. As you might recall from yeah. the No More Heroes games. I don't like where this is going at all. This is a boss. All right. Oh! Good catch. There we go. That didn't seem especially difficult. So far, no, but this is, you know, first first stage, so sure. you expect it to take her a little easy on you. I expect to eat those words later. But giant coins falling out of enemies, a slot machine, uh, you know, iconography, yep. this is a Suda 51 game. Sure. All right, destroy rate, 100%. Throwing 110 fastballs. I'm pretty good. All right, let's see what the uh, the next area looks like. Let's see if there's any actual like movement. Twenty four different diabolical dishes. What are my uh, my what's my card collection? Okay, so I can buy these then. Uh, I have just fifty four, so I'm gonna buy yeah, cannonball. Sounds good. Oh, wait, it looks like you need two cards though to use that. Yeah, there's also jump and squat. All right, I've spent all my money here. Uh, let's see if I can use that. Or if you're right, yeah, it looks like I'm... Yeah, I said you had one of two cannonballs. Okay. Then on to the next area. He's all... No! Don't think that's how you catch baseballs. All right. Oh, this is a little tougher. Oh, it's a tiger. Activate. Again, God Hand style there. Yeah. Okay, there I was, I missed one. Oh. Come on. Oh, Golden Glove over there. No, I want what it. What is that? That's a point. Did that do anything for you? Oh, man. Oh, that was what the Golden Glove did. That was an automatic save. That was great. Oh, there he is off to the side. It's <laughs> pretty good. Glad I have him. Alright. Fire. Activate. Definitely sometimes not getting the register here. I guess we, we should point out it is uh, it's early days for Connect Quick Looks in the new office. Uh, yeah. Kinda, we're still tinkering with lights, and uh, there's a whole lot of cables in here. So this may not be the optimum Connect environment. 
No, I don't want those sevens. I want more bars. What is that speed doing for you up there? Does that mean anything? Ah! Well, I think you need to activate. Fire. Boosh. Awesome! No more coins. Kind of not a lot to it. Yeah, it's kind of open for a little bit more. Uh oh, king well, elephant. The king of the elephants. <laughs> Spear guys with the blood out of the trunk. Oh, this. Wait, that was it. Did you get it? Yeah. Oh. I thought, about, I thought he was about to bust out with something real unpleasant there. He is. His death! That elephant fell to pieces. Just love this just no-nonsense baseball player. Yeah. Like, yeah. No, no twist on it. He's just all-American stoic baseball player. That's he's not, it. He's not phased. No. Sure, he'll put on a weird mechanical arm that the devil gave him. All right, let's see if I can buy the other part of that cannon. Hey, hey. Oh, not quite. Oh, God damn it, David. What kind of power-ups you got in there? I don't need zero right now. Yeah, it doesn't look like I've unlocked any. Nothing doing for now. Here's what the multiplayer cards look like. Uh oh. Seems like that could be useful at some point. Can I just uh, can I just tag into the story mode, or is that a totally separate thing? I think we need to. Let's uh, actually. I'll, I'll exit here because it, it seems like there's pretty easy level select in between areas. Um, that's fine. Because uh, I am curious to see what the multiplayer looks like. See how close you got to get here. Let's do it. Uh, to play, uh... Uh, I am still right. Oh, there you are. Righty. I want you to move forward. All right. Let's do this. And then move to the left. Then move forward. And then move to the left. There you go. All right. Okay, so it looks like it is a separate okay. thing for, uh, for co-op. Let's pitch. Oh, wait well, a minute. Okay, no. Well, All right. Let's see the third area. Let's do it. Oh, I'm going to go thunder. Yeah, that's... You know, if you're going to go thunder, then I'll go fire just so we have the variety. Okay, your turn. Wait. You definitely gotta go. They want me to do this. Oh. Oh, this is still tutorializing here. Oh, dear. Nice. All right. It's a little bit of technique to that. Yeah, yeah. And, and you definitely like, you know, the, the big motions. Well, Both hands. There you right, go. Right. Ah. Well, that's teamwork. <laughs> what a silly game. That's fun. I like that. It's, yeah, it's all right. You're right. It is silly, but uh, <clears throat> but what do you expect right. from a supernatural baseball pitching game? It does seem very specific about where it wants you. Yeah. You definitely want to go, like, big motion. Diabolical. 
I'm not really getting the sense that I'm aiming at anything. Oh. Yeah, you really gotta go up and over. Let me watch. Okay. There it is. Oops. <clears throat> Looks like I'm being picked up very well here. Realize I've spent two thirds of my week so far kicking at a TV. <laughs> Thunder. Yeah, you, get, you get better, better yeah, coverage damage. there. That was a little wasted. So, what is the point of this thing? Oh, it looks like you, it allows oh, wow. you to target stuff very specifically. That helps. Holy crap! I wish I had that thing now. Fire. Oh. <laughs> the noise the elephant <laughs> makes. <laughs> I'm still. I'm still. It looks like once you get the target locked on, you can yeah. drop the catching hand. Okay. Fantastic. Fire. Attack missile by locking on. Oh. Yep. Dude, throw the ball. What's going on? Oh. I'm up. I'm down. I'm down. Oh, right. Hello. <laughs> Help. God Help. It, God damn it, connect. Help. I'm trying. Help. I'm trying. I think we're screwed. <laughs> Boned by crappy technology. Ugh. Oh, thank you. Move forward. Move forward. I'm trying. Why is this not happening? Shit. Oh, God, those close. Oh. oh, not close enough. Damn it. Damn it. So still uh, some some connect wonkiness with it, especially yeah. it seems like it's it's greater when you've got two players. Yep. Uh, unsurprisingly, and again, the studio a little a little bit of a work sure, in progress. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, we, we don't we don't uh, we haven't calibrated everything here, but you know what? You probably you're going to have pretty similar problems at home because it's connect. <laughs> a true to life experience. Exactly. So yeah. that's uh, that's diabolical pitch uh, yeah. available now yeah. on Xbox Live Arcade. Brad, thanks for pitching with yeah, me. Yeah. Thanks for catching. Hail Satan.